I'm gonna say, let me close this. There we go. All right, so today we're going to talk about mittens and gloves. And I am going to show you some language for mittens. So we're going to put our, our hand up like this. And we're going to, we're going to put our hand up like this. And we're going to pretend like we're putting on mittens. And then you change your other hand, put it down and pretend to put on mittens. So this means mittens. All right, I have some pictures to show of mittens and gloves. Here we go. So we wear mittens to keep our hands warm. That's why I was showing you the language for like when we go outside to play in the snow. But there's other reasons where the gloves too. Let me show you another picture. What's this little girl doing? Can you tell what she's doing? Cooking. She is. She looks like she's baking either muffins or maybe cupcakes. She has on what we call oven mitts. They're like mittens for your hands. So you can take hot things in and out of the oven without burning your hands. Has on her oven mittens. So that's another time that we wear mittens. How about this? This one says doctors wear gloves to protect them from germs. You know, when you get to the doctor and the doctor has on a pair of blue gloves like this. And when we go to visit the dentist, our dentist also has on, these are called surgical gloves. And the reason that we have these on is to keep our hands from germs so that we doctors and dentists stay healthy. Here's one more. What are they doing outside? What, what is Making this person flowers. doing? They're planting flowers. They are a gardener. And this picture tells us that gardeners wear gloves to keep their hands clean when they're working. So we wear mittens and gloves. Hi, Tatum. We wear mittens and gloves for different reasons. We wear them to keep our hands warm. We wear them to keep our hands clean. We wear them to keep our hands from getting burnt, to keep our hands safe. And if we're a doctor or a nurse, or a dentist, we wear them to keep germs away. Oh, there we are back. So I have a mitten song to sing with you, and then we're going to play a mitten game. I've got my mittens back here behind me. So here's my mitten song. It says, oh, do you wear the mittens now, the mittens now, the mittens now. Oh, do you wear the mittens now that it's winter time? Oh, yes, I wear the mittens now, the mittens now, the mittens now. Oh, yes, I wear the mittens now that it's winter time. All right, I'm going to sing again. You can sing with me. And this time when I say mittens, I'm going to do my sign language. I'm going to pretend like I'm putting on my mittens. All right. Oh, do you wear the mittens now, the mittens now, the mittens now? Or do you wear the mittens now that it's winter time? I guess we could have done the sign for winter too, right? Oh, yes, I wear the mittens now, the mittens now, the mittens now. Oh, yes, I wear the mittens now that it's winter time. All right, are you ready to play our mitten game? All right, so here is how we're going to play. Behind me, let me move a little bit and let me move this up so that we can. I see it. M I T T N. Yes, I like how you know all of those letters. It is the letters that spell mitten. M I T E N. So, since these are mittens that we wear in the snow to keep our hands warm when we play outside. I have a snowflake. So I'm going to cover up my camera. I'm going to hide a snowflake and I'm going to let everybody have a turn and you have to guess where the snowflake is hiding. You'll have to tell me what letter it is 
that has the snowflake hiding behind it. You can cover up the camera. Yep. Okay, are you ready? All right, Trace, you can go first. Which letter do you think the snowflake is hiding behind? Which one do you think it is? Orange. The orange one. This is letter T. Let's see if he's right. There it is. Good job. Good job. All right, I'm going to cover up the camera again. All right, are you ready? All right, and it's your turn. What letter has the snowflake behind it? M. Okay, you think it's letter M? Let's see. You were right too. I have two right answers so far. All right, I'm gonna cover up the camera, cover up your eye, hide it again. All right, ready to look? Huddy, it's yes. your turn. What letter do uh, you think that the snowflake is behind? Uh, I think. N. Let's see if it's behind letter N. Can you believe it? All three of you all had the wrong right answer when it was your turn. That was awesome. Good job. Yay for all of you. Hooray. All right. It was nice to see everybody this morning. Everyone wave and tell Trace. Say see you later. Hey, we'll get to see you later, in later Trace. Days. In just a few days, we'll be back at school with our friends. Everybody wave to Jason. Say see you later. Goodbye, Jason. Bye. Bye. That was nice. Bye. Thank you, honey. Bye. And everybody wave to Honey and say see you later. See you later. It was good to see all of you.